Welcome back on GamerMage Zero. So last time we were setting up these manufacturers to help us to produce the um, oscillators. What was it called? The crystal oscillators. Now ultimately, I don't think these really require a ton of uh, material. So that makes things really easy, and they don't. The only problem is they don't really output them very fast. So I maybe am going to get to a minute, maybe. So, that's going to be the problem. So I have maybe six every minute. Man, that means that even these three going at max capacity, I'm only going to get one every ten seconds. And that's three manufacturers. I feel like the supercomputer moves faster than that. That's not true, by the way. It's like one every two seconds. So it's like, they're about comparable. I think they're just a little bit faster. So we only need three items for this, but the quartz crystal is going to be one of those. But let's make sure we have everything else we need in here first. So we're really close to the top of this thing. I think for the moment that should work. Now the question is, am I moving cable fast enough? I have some cable over here. Well, let's just check it out. So we have 15 cables per minute, or cable per minute. One, two, three, four, five. So 50 plus 25, so 75. We have about 75 cable a minute coming out. So that's just a little bit above. And then we need 30 wires a minute. And I think we're getting that. But I'm not sure. So how much did we actually need over here? I'm wondering because I think we have a second thing of copper. That's not here though. Anyways, let's check this out. We need 26 minute. <coughs> Excuse me. So that means we need almost two assemblers for that. So let's go ahead and at least get this going here. So let's get a splitter down. is not giving me a line like that is. Alright, so we will see is that close enough? So we know on that line there is where it is. Okay, I think we're on the line. Yep. Okay. Now I need a little bit farther away. Dang it. Splitter.
That actually should be good. Okay. So we'll do this. And then... There we go. So we have three... coming from this direction. Let's get another one coming from here. This time it's going to show me the line. Good. Two. Three. That'll give us the whole supply we need, and so that's going to give us the distance. Let's take a look at the throughput we're going to need. So, we're going to need about 19. Let's just round it to 20 a minute. So, 60 a minute. So, I really don't need it that high. So, we'll maybe do... So, we'll do the conveyor belt one to each of those. I actually don't know if quartz is going to be this one. This one's probably going to be cable. So how much do I need for throughput on this? Actually, reinforced iron plates, I'm going to need 7.5, so that's 21, 22, to 23, somewhere around 20, 23. I don't exactly want to do that, but I think we're going to. Let's see. Alright, let's do a splitter right there. I think we only really need... Let's do it like this. Even with this here, this is still going to be more than enough. Whoa! Glitch just kind of threw me in the air. Okay. Alright, and then that's cables that I need 26 a minute for, so let's just say almost 30 a minute. So that one's going to be an MK2, just in case, at least from here to here, so. Oops. 
Okay, now we just need one more set of these conveyor poles. Everything's hooked up now. Now I just need to get the next line of materials, which is going to be the cable. Okay, let's see if I can make this work. So we'll do two up. <coughs> Excuse me. I'll want that more for just reference. Alright, so we're going to want the MK2 going from this to this. From here to here. the cable come into it now. Alright, now all we have to do is... Constructor... Actually, what I probably want to do doesn't matter what it is splitter something let's do a constructor and then we can use that to line up where we want this to be Seems perfect. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six. Alright, let's see how that works. So these can make fifteen a minute. And I only need 10 a minute, so 1, 2, 3, 30. I only really need two of those. Three of these. Two of those. I know I just went back and forth a little bit, but that's just two of these. Because these are 15 a minute. Interesting. So actually, do I even need to do that here then?
So in that case, I'm just going to really just build this constructor here. One, two, and three. That's going to be more than enough. Put the splitter down right there. Turn it around. And <laughs> they built these all the wrong direction. Of course I did. Okay. That looks like it's going the right direction now. doing the MK2. There we go. Oh, I need 30 a minute, so that means this is going to be fine. Let's do the MK2 for this part. And unfortunately, I think that means what we want to do is actually break this right here. Yes, okay. Just wondering why that was out a little bit. that up. What in the world? Is it because of this? I feel like that's right. Anyways. Wait, did I make these go the wrong direction again? Nope. Okay, those are going the right direction. here. This one's going to face this direction, but then this one... We'll do regular conveyor belt this way. Oops. Regular conveyor belt. There we go. Now the MK2. Seems like a really good place to put that, actually. Let's see. Will that go... Yep. Okay. So 
One, two, three. goes. That's pretty cool. It's like little plastic bins. So it needs 10 to get started here. And I have three. If I want to, I could just boost these quite a bit. I don't think I need to. These take such a long time. What I might do though... Ooh. I didn't even think about that. Okay. So we're just about done producing the first one. And... There it is. Alright, so... So I think we're full up on everything, it's just the quartz crystals that are taking a little bit of time to get in there. Alright, I think that's just going to be where we leave it for this episode. I might speed this up because you need a bunch of those crystal oscillators. I just need like, I think, ten of them even to get the next research point going. And I don't have to wait like a, a minute for what six of them so it's gonna take me like two minutes to get just ten of them and I think I need even more than that for the vehicle so anyways we'll go ahead and end the episode there so if you like the episode please or uh, like any part of the series please hit like and subscribe make sure to hit the notification bell at the bottom of your screen and uh, leave some comments on what you like didn't like things that you think I can improve on or do or um, things that you want me to do or places you want me to go. So thank you guys very much, and we'll see you next time.